Wait, what now? It looks like a PlayStation. What, the next Xbox? Yeah. Somebody must be ahead of yeah, please, so, please, somebody in the somebody in the stage say it looks like a PlayStation. Also, there's the new Kinect. Uh, oh, gee, oh, uh, oh. <laughs> I mean, it looks nice. It looks like a PlayStation. It's got the same color scheme and everything. And just imagine the people when we were watching the PS4 conference. There were a bunch of people saying, "Oh well, the so the PlayStation I looks like a Kinect. Now the Kinect 2.0 looks like a PSI, which looks like a Kinect." Maybe also, they're trying to get is, revenge. I don't know. Also, there's a button on the controller. I don't that, I don't know what it does. It's like a squ it's a two squares fucking cloud powered. The controller. But seriously, that's the design of the new Xbox? And people were complaining that the Wii U was bland. I mean... Same. The Xbox Slim has the... Xbox One. That's, a, that's not the first Xbox you went <laughs> <laughs> It's not the first Xbox. This the first it. Xbox really back in, like, I think the 20th century. Or early 21st, <laughs> I can't remember. The Xbox One. It's like, oh, so it's a prototype? See, the buttons look. The controller looks decent. Yeah, I like the controller a little. Is built to amaze yeah, it looks. A, it looks a lot more sleek. But the console itself should be sleek. I'm sorry, but I prefer the Xbox 360 slim design even more than. I, I thought like I saw some liminal messaging corner, pop up, but no, it's just camera flash. The principles we oh, follow okay. were to be simple, instant, and complete. I don't want to join the conversation. Please welcome. They want to hear the audio fluctuate right there. The new experiences you'll find only on Xbox no, but I am gonna smell bullshit if these new experiences on Xbox One change anything. You so smitty. Who's this guy? Thanks, Don. Good morning. You so smitty. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Who are any of these people? Here at Xbox, it's no secret. Are we even we familiar with any of the Microsoft employees? The epic battles, um, and the I guess we will be eventually. Uh, I mean, it would be nice. I mean, it would have. It would have been nice for them to just be like, "Use like Mehdi, a director of Microsoft, a head of something or other, head of cleaning the toilet." Like, I'm sorry, you're no Miyamoto. Not everyone on the planet and their children and their unborn children know you. You're not Reggie Fils-Aimé. Your body is not ready. Now, let me set up the oh, let's see oh, that, that button right there. You what see the button behind him on the screen? Is that another share button? I'm trying to figure out what the fuck is that button and why are those two boxes turn on your fucking? TV and talk to all of the devices in your living room. But still, is always this is not the first Xbox, you idiots. Well, now it's all going to begin with two simple words. Xbox uh, okay, so you can control it with your voice. Yay. Wait, wait, so it's voice recognition or recognize your voice exclusively? And it's that simple. What if I can pull off a damn good impression of you? Me and gets me to my own personal home what system. if you have a list? No more manual login, no more waiting and system dev, What if you're um, mute? I'm not, I'm not making fun of people who have lists, but interface. what if you have what a heavy accent or something? If you're mute. First of all, it'll remember what I was last doing. Maybe it could be like a clapper. So here in the center Clap of the on. Screen, Clap off. What, what, is your, what is your name? This Welcome one here is just one of the new Xbox amazing Connect. Xbox One exclusives. You're gonna oh wait, the Kinect 2.0. If it's precision, maybe it could be good with sign language. I mean, that'd be and nice. Movie. Mm -hmm. I now, hope. Like many of you, I also discovered new and of course, their Xbox that, One looks like Windows 8, just with more black. Uh, it looks like the it looks like the regular the Xbox 360 freaking menu screen, but with more black. So apparently there is an option on Windows 8 to let you go to the normal desktop appearance, but it's a pain in the ass to do so. Nah, I'm still waiting for all the compatibility issues to be worked out. I mean, yeah, it's nice of you, Microsoft, to drop the price for Windows 8 to like what 60 bucks, as opposed to the as opposed to what the 120 usually charge for OS up upgrades. But uh, yeah, unless you bring that shit down to 20, you're not going to get my money. <laughs> Microsoft, I'm still not throwing my money. The screen. All that is going to change I don't, with Xbox. Why do we have a game show on screen? Is it the Price is Right? Xbox. It is the Price is Right. <laughs> I should go 
Maybe you two are recording this. Hi, Drew. I am. Oh God, geez. Drew. Drew, why are why are you want to like this commercial? Did you sign your rights away to this? Hold on. Let me show you how we're gonna. I don't think I want to. I can't remember what Drew is telling that woman right now. Can you imagine what how awkward that conversation would have been? Okay, Mr. Carey, here's what's gonna happen. We're gonna be unveiling the next Xbox. No. But wait, 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 I just, I just thought of this, I just thought of this. Go what if, for some odd reason, you're watching a commercial showing off the next Xbox, and then the person in the commercial yes, is going like, Xbox ah, on, Xbox ones? off! Your Xbox shuts off! Oh, oh, Go to Internet Explorer. Oh, oh boy, nice. this, oh boy, Watch the Lens TV. Player channel, I love that channel. Watch movie. God damn it, J.J. Abrams. Switching between hey, those live movies TV are great. And all my games entertain. No, let's how fast to demonstrate this at E3 with like hundreds of people on the showroom all talking at once in the demonstration booth. That's going to be hell with the uh, with the voice recognition. Hey, it is the Star Trek. It is Star Trek. Just as such yeah, also with voice with the voice recognition. What if you have like a cold in your voice sounds so totally different or something? By the way, uh, by the way, I'm going to totally be a product core here for anyone who has not seen the new Star Trek movie, watch it now. Trust me, it's home. amazing. I'm not going to spoil it for you. Trust and me, if I it's get good. Back to buy a movie, really good. I grab, and I'm back to the movie. <coughs> I don't know. The, f and again, the original Xbox was finicky in regards to your... in regards to motion you capturing with your hands. Do, like, there were a handful of games that were hard to track your hands. <laughs> Sorry, free rider, excuse me. Yeah, it must have the same call going on. ...on your TV is now a reality. Introducing Snap Mode for the Xbox. Xbox, Snap Mode. Of Internet course, Explorer. fucking Internet Explorer. Mm. Yep. Snap mode, I Better have the option to let us. I mean, if this is going to be an app machine. Did anyone hear that? What? Uh, guards drove another. past me. I'm sitting in my living room. Xbox, favorites. Oh. So no yeah, one that. Star Trek. Microsoft Internet Explorer. Okay, so right the best now, browser to download Trek, another browser. Great things about the sequel, Star Trek into Darkness. Oh, to start. The so best person to quote old jokes. And my cell phone is Hello, talk to you. The best person to mock me every time I open my mouth. No, that's Max. And I can even well, he's no longer part of the team, so yeah, you'll tickets. suffice. And again, really, I thought that'd be my out, job. Go well, you do a pretty good job too. And I'm home. I think two, we are right. two halves of the same of the same bit as. Two sides of the same coin. Like your bit is more logical side. I am his stupidest. Skype. So Skype on Xbox Skype will be Xbox indeed revolutionary, because it's not like you could already do that on your Windows PC. I mean, how the fuck are we talking right now? <laughs> but I mean, well, let's see how, let's just see how intrusive or how well it, Skype will work with Xbox One. And I honestly hope that the Skype app on this Xbox One will have audio regulation. So and that way, off, your Skype call is not being DJ, diminished the by the game you're playing. I mean, could you imagine if you're playing Gears of War 4, right which we know is going to happen? Actually, Gears of War 5. Xbox. Gears of War 4 is kind of like Gears of War Judgment. But what if that game is so loud that I can barely hear you hey, guys? DJ, thank you for calling in to help me show off Skype and Snap hey. Mode. Looks like you're working pretty anyway, hard uh, there. So, am I the one who's paying more hey, attention to the movie than the actual I'm conference? You know, it looks like you're doing okay yourself. Well, I'm, I'm trying to pay to attention to the conference, but I guess I don't blame you. Oh, I'm sorry. These were good movies, well, fact, and I'm actually next. curious. So did they have to pay J.J. Abrams to put, the, to put this in here, sure or, he or is he sponsoring this? The real My joke! You know, the one where I'm in first place. Maybe yeah, it's yeah, a little yeah. bit of both. Oh, boy. Fourth. Let me go ahead and show you that Xbox sports offering that DJ was talking about. I'm going to increase the volume of this thing in here a little better. No problem. All right, let me set up the scene here. Imagine I'm at home watching an NBA game during the regular season. But if you're like me, I like to keep up. Now let's keep up with my fantasy team. Now I All right, I can listen to a little Justin Bieber. God God damn it! Let me be reminded of Captain Pan's on, you, uh, get an alert, mocking of at Microsoft's conferences say, from the past, being like, "You don't fantasy. need a connect. You can still stick with PS and Move and the Wii." But I wonder if he'll make a response to this. Really, one of my favorites here, and that stats update live. But in addition, I can go ahead and check out league standings. So what, you also see, need your phone in order for this to work? Let me guess, are we going to need a fucking Android? And in addition, 
I can go ahead here and have a nice thing. Or is this another screen so to utilize with the Xbox One, so which will come with screen. it? Okay, so all in all, how many hundreds of dollars are we going to have to spend to have everything available? How long is it said to go on for? Actually, that's what I'm going to ask you guys. How much do you think this is all going to cost? Five hundred and ninety-nine US dollars. Just kidding. <laughs> well, there's, there's yeah, okay. voice recognition, Connect 2.0. The console itself, with this ability to have the possible Android we have to buy. Finally, I'm saying, what I, think is the biggest I don't know why I'm saying $300 at least. Mm. For me, it's finding what to watch. Probably more than that. Three hundred dollars at minimum. Mm -hmm. yeah. the Xbox One guy. That's my. Well, I guess we'll have to wait until we get some specifications. Xbox, show the guy. Because right now it's just seeming now like an entertainment box. I mean, like general entertainment ways. and just gaming. Wait, wait, wait. Did we, did we, wait, are we essentially doing the prices Favorites right with this thing right after we just off prices right? This is essentially right. direct TV. Wait, what you the fuck? You'll uh, get a free Xbox uh, I got a buffering, I got a buffering thing. Xbox, today show. I might be, I might be synced up with Aku now. Watch Sci-Fi Channel. Hmm. Watch MTV. Wait, did HBO stutter? What's on HBO? Um, a little. No, we don't need to see that again. Let's just go to the games. Or go to the specifications of the device. Mary and Martha. Hi, Drew. Watch CBS. Okay, that's it. I am going to get my dog out. Let me know when they show some games or specifications. See how easy it is? No more memorizing channels or left. hunting for remote control. The Xbox One. The next thing I want to show you is how I stay on top of all of the series that I love to follow. I still can't get over the name. Xbox favorites. <laughs> The favorite I don't think the Hobbit TV, TV show. With all the TV shows that I like to watch, all I have to do is bring the TV the adaption. The Hobbit. TV in place. It's a lot like having my own personal channel. And finally, there's one of the areas I like the most: Xbox trending. What's trending? trending oh my God! I see one of the shows my niece loves Xbox up there. Watching. Wait, what now? Right there, top right corner. That's Doc McStuffins. From here, I can instantly jump into the most popular shows. That's the show my niece. Let the audience know how you know that. But trending my niece isn't just loves for live it. TV. There's also a section they for said video that already. Demand, so I can see what people oh, okay. are liking no matter what time zone it's in. Xbox, go Xbox, home! Go home. Xbox, get the fuck out of so my face. So there you have it. The all-in-one system where it all comes yeah. Xbox, Games, execute moves, order 66. Music, web, and now, Skype and Xbox, live TV. Xbox, kill the president. The one place where you are now <laughs> entertainment. Damn it. The one place where it's <laughs> simple and instant to connect with your friends. Uh, I w this at this point, I would, I, would, I would make a download of pizza joke right here, but that's already been this done. This is the beginning of true You would download a pizza. Oh, wait, now we can. Now I'd like to exactly. Right into the stage that's my to point. Show you the magic and science that makes all of this possible. Okay, yeah. so Thank you. we have just learned that the Xbox One can be controlled with your voice and sh check out television. We also learned that Microsoft can't count. Thanks, Yusuf. At Xbox, we're focused Seriously, on how you Xbox play, One. That comes before 360. To build a future -proof system so now that we have all three names, you need to with all of your Yusuf just showed you intelligent What are your favorite uh, next generation console, console names? The Wii U, the PS4, and the, the Xbox One. I'm thrilled I to be say, able to show you I under say, the uh, and give Wii U is pretty the interesting. Xbox. The PS4 is just continuing the number. Xbox One, you can't count Microsoft. <laughs> First, the uh, for me, and the let's see. I'm not, I'm not a fan of any of the names, quite personally. That's Second, why I said they all suck. The names the are not... Uh, don't really connect, leave a big impression on me to be... And smart uh, give my own opinion. And third, PS4 is Xbox neutral. Live, this is all it's just continuing the numbers. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. They just, you know, PS1, 2, 3, 4, that makes sense. It's an elegant design yeah, go ahead, the needs of the new generation. Huh? Go ahead. The heart of that system is raw power. Oh, right. Uh, well, hang on. They're now getting to the specs of this thing. The Xbox 360 to so it has 8 gigs of RAM. 5 billion transistors. USB oh, so this thing's going to have Blu-ray finally? A Blu-ray drive. A native 64-bit architecture. PS4 Beach did that years ago, man. PS4, PS4. They should have done a handful of this with a 360. Operation. That's why I was pissed off with this the original version because it, you needed to buy an extra adapter for well Wi-Fi, and, and that ran you a hundred bucks. It's PS, how we PS3, on the power. other hand, had built-in Blu-ray, and even the Wii had Wi-Fi. Mediocre Wi-Fi with some games, but yeah. it had Wi-Fi nonetheless. To do this, the only thing I didn't really like about the Wii is that it wasn't capable of DVD. Yeah, what was up with that? The soul of the new system. I guess Nintendo wanted to stick with an actual gaming console, and why they they were actually asked this with the Wii U, and they said. 
In this day and age, you probably already have a DVD player. One in your computer, one in your household, one in your kitchen. That's understandable. I mean, already. I mean, for like, even the PlayStation 2 could play DVDs. Well, still, I'm fine with that. I was well, DVDs were kind of like brand new at that time. Well, yeah, true, but still. I remember the days back when people, back when advertisements for movies coming to home, coming to the ability, ability to play on home, they would say coming to VHS and DVD. Yeah, and besides Nintendo, Only Nintendo was also Xbox like, well, we also have all those streaming movies that a lot of people will do nowadays: Netflix, Hulu, Amazon. I remember back when like, uh, I have a question. What? Is it possible for me to get rid of the stupid no banner that keeps moving around and asks me and tells me say see what people are saying about Xbox or on on Twitter? Uh, there we get rid uh, of that. How did the TV know you said no, the it's tied to you like a ball and chain, man. We're Just bear with it. I think that's why there's not, why I had to buffer it for the, a little bit there. The because this thing's animating and taking up a lot of the freaking connection I should be using on the video. Mm-hmm. Be gone, Yeah, this is Microsoft. Don't bother. You're, that's like asking for ads to disappear on the dashboard. It's not going to happen. About 13 billion right, so they're gonna make shit add blocker. That it takes individual photons to bounce off of you to create unprecedented accuracy and precision. Over two gigabits of data per second. So in other words, it's gonna be able to transmit more data to the X, to stuff. the Connect 2.0. These are the things will create new faster. You're seriously saying this thing, like this thing is like on the level of rocket science? Three years ago. I don't. Uh, apparently, I don't. You want to raise the price even more? I don't. I don't think NASA is working with Microsoft to create a fucking console. We Meanwhile, in NASA, to see your world. I think they're too busy now on their private islands with their pina colada since they're not doing anything. Uh, of your world. As you saw with use of Skype calls, Meanwhile, the rover's busy drawing a giant phallic symbol on Mars, so yeah, probably not doing much. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Uh, just imagine with Skype with the Xbox Net 2.0. Granted, you would no longer need a microphone or a headset, but it's like, oh, you want to talk with your friends? Okay, let's show them your face. Okay, seriously, we're watching yoga. Okay, here's some fighting that could be used for the, the game. Transfer of weight from one Maybe it's dulcing, yoga, and the fighting. Energy of emotion. Now, what about recognizing when your fingers? <clears throat> well, it looks like we're getting more detailed now. This is human control for a human experience. Can we do a side-by-side -side comparison? Now, we wouldn't bring you next-generation gameplay. Oh, well, yeah, what the controller has. Yeah, like, can you tell me what that button looks like two boxes fucking it does now? And we're making it better. I really want to know what that button does. Updated with over four I don't think I want to know. It features updated ergonomics. Let's see, and battery, battery compartment, compartment impulse trigger. Of all ages. Wait, integrated battery. Com okay, good. It's rechargeable, right? Allow creators to program this day and age, you can't really have a console that has a rechargeable and a battery. Well, that's why I have with a 360, even with its redesigned. This redesigned. I have a recharge. I have rechargeable 360 gamers, controllers. I mean, they have prompts. But you had to get in the rechargeable pack, right? Uh, yeah. But honestly, did you use the well, big that's the thing. You needed a rechargeable pack. Here's the thing. Even with that, they had connection problems. Problem. So I still have to plug Xbox. them in anyway. Your tablet can instantly mm -hmm. become a remote control and a deep companion experience. We've had Are those downloads willing? Oh, smart glass! Were those downloads willing, or did you force with it? This new generation, your smart and how? And more so, like all more those smart glass Xbox downloads. Who, it's who cares, really? Platform. I I don't remember Connect, hearing anyone actually giving a damn about smart glass. Smart seriously, glass. I never did. Innovative, it's really their half-ass attempt at trying to mimic the Wii U with two way. controllers instead of one. I actually have a 360 in my bedroom along with my Wii now, but I hardly use a damn thing. The new mm. Connect sensor is the binding I mean, in our games, I do play devices. on the Xbox. I actually, when you press contrary to popular belief, I, I, I when you change the as you, well, probably not popular, device. but contrary to what I'm saying right now, I'm a big fan of actually the Halo franchise. Controller, I don't play online, though, because I hate the, the idiots online. And it gets you into your latest game <laughs> that's the internet instantly. for you. But I still Go for the gameplay, not for the, for the community. community. Yep, that's why I, I love Halo for the single player and the local multiplayer. Your devices work in harmony to create a lag-free... Instant I don't care if I've got a smaller experience. screen if I play local multiplayer. At least I know the guy sitting next to me is not going to call me a bitch if I fucking accidentally kill the guy I'm supposed to. Right. You know where he lives. The next generation of games and you're going to kill him. You need access to the most powerful and I'm probably just going to slap service. him across the face or something. The new Xbox Live is built on Xbox Okay, One what does Xbox Live have? New generation. Are we going to have Based free on online the like the PS3 today, has? But now more powerful, more personal, and more intelligent. When we launched Xbox Live in 2000, yeah, just tell us that it's free and I'll be interested. <laughs> if the not, then the you could really kiss my ass. 
Today, what if it was just still a really cheap price? Servers power the it better be Xbox cheap, like experience. five bucks for an entire but year. This year, we will have more than no, three hundred thousand servers for Xbox One. More than the entire yeah, make it three, make it like five bucks a year. You'll see that world, you'll see that globe light up than a fucking Christmas tree in New York. Let's talk about the experiences enabled with all that power. Your content is available and it's My dad is a, a big so Microsoft fan, so movies, actually count on me music, having a full subscription games, Xbox Live saves, if he, anytime, if it's decreased if it's decreased in price. As you've seen today, You're here. all new experiences. Is the Xbox Live really Skype, is actually free? It's like freaking gold membership. What you need to actually do anything TV. is and fucking games expensive. Is brought to a whole new level. Yep. Just imagine. You will now have a dedicated game DVR to it's capture like the free to play game, but you have to pay extra to have to what cloud. stuff you want in the game. With our native How much is the cloud going to cost we'll us? The most amazing bragging rights on Xbox Live. That's what I'm curious about. Sony offers the same thing, thing as well, but you have to be like a PlayStation Plus member. Looks like the Saints were the third level up system. Just what you've done. You will play richer matches. With the I need to take you back making. into that, Aku. And our new asynchronous capability will allow you to search for your perfect match in your favorite game while you play another game. While I wonder how taxing this is all going to be on your connection. And finally, That's what I'm oh worried Lord. about with the uh, concept of streaming of for both the Xbox One and the PS4. They're gonna, they're nothing but stream this, this stream that, stream this while you stream that. It's like, what it if your connection is not all that great? Work. Are you gonna hash? Are we gonna have to hashtag deal with it? I remember back when that thing wasn't called the hashtag. There you have it. Breakthrough Xbox One architecture, next generation inputs anchored by Connect and a completely redefined Xbox Live.